Hi Wendy. Well, I've known you for more than a decade. How old it makes us sound, but our memories will never fade. To the years ahead, let's make them count. We were once secondary school kids, and we formed an unlikely bond. You saved me from being bullied. You were my light at the break of dawn. There were times we drifted apart. Different friends, different places, different jobs. But the currents always pushed us back together. Like magnets, our bond will always come up top. You are at the start of a new journey, a new beginning to a perfect ending. And I'm glad there's someone else to make you happy. I will always cherish you, my god sister, my dearest Wendy. Hi Wendy, I'm really happy that we got closer through the music that we both enjoy. Attending gigs and emo's night together is my favorite moment spent with you. You never fail to spread happiness and joy to people around you. I'm really glad to be a friend of yours. Please continue to carry this bubbly vibe wherever you go. Love you. Hi. You know, I remember you telling me this crazy story about how you guys met. And from then on, almost every time I met you, you'd have this new relationship milestone that you wanted to share with me. And honestly, I don't think I've seen you happier or more certain. So I'm just really happy for you. And I know that Carissa will be so proud, so proud of you as well. Congrats! I'm so happy that I've come across over the past few years. I hope that you can continue being happy, continue being cheery, and just continue spreading love amongst everyone that you meet. And I can be happier for you for whatever that's gonna come next. Hello, sisters from another mother. Thank you for watching this video. I can assure you that this is not a promotional video about your pop, but it's about you. I'm very happy that we crossed path um, in SSS and Thank you for always thinking of me, especially during this period of time. I will always be your listening ear, just to let you know that I really appreciate you as my friend, my sister, and I'm really grateful that you found someone that really loves you. So am I! Hello my dear, I just want to thank you for coming to my life and bringing colours to it. You are the sweetest and the most genuine person I've ever met. I recall the first time I've ever saw you, back in secondary school, I couldn't take my eyes off. 
I never knew that I would be so lucky to be able to love you and to be loved by you. I admire all your courage in life to pursue things that you really like and how you always face us the world despite your fears. Your love is sacrificial. Every weekend, you can choose to go out for parties or you choose to spend it with your family. And now mine. You have been through several heartbreaks, but each time, you grow to be someone stronger. I don't like those who hurt you, but I'm also glad that it's because of them that I have this opportunity to spend my life with you. Thank you for all your support and always encouraging me in every life decision I make. I promise to do on you and to protect you with all my heart. And I want to grow old with you. <laughs> Will you marry me? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Then I met you. From day one, you insisted on meeting me every day despite our busy schedules. Above all, you listened and you wanted to keep learning about me. The attention you give to me every day filled uh, my self worth to the brim. But what is the most special thing about you <laughs> is that the gift. <laughs> is that you will watch my expressions and monitor the level of happiness and self-worth as though any drop to that grim level would be ca catastrophic. <laughs> That's what made you special. Your love always kept for my feelings and the key word here was be always. You tell me every time that my feelings are valid and address them, not through coaxing but with logic. You refuse to let me believe at any point that I'm any lesser and you never let me sleep upset. Somehow you managed to make me believe I'm special because you chose to love me so much more than any fairy tale self of mine could ever imagine. Thank you for the consistency you're giving me. My first poem about you was titled I Forgot Our Anniversary Day and it's about how every day felt equally special. You made me realize that your love didn't require me to hoard. You didn't need me to remember how much love you gave on special occasions through gifts or grand gestures. Like this one. Because I felt the same amount of love for you every day. I might still be afraid from time to time, but I'm certain I wouldn't have to go to bed afraid with your comforts and with you by my side. So today I devote myself to you forever and I strive to be as consistent as you have knowing that regardless of the decade that we, in which we have met that I will still love you enough that you don't have to remember our anniversaries or what I say today to be loved <laughs> actually, actually, I, <laughs> actually I also got a ring but the ring has a record shopping <laughs> Today是你的大日子，啊，也是你人生的一个决定。啊，祝你成功、幸福、永远美丽、健康。爸爸都永远觉得你是最好、最聪明。继续努力，加油！ Hi, Papi. Today is a very important day, and I'm so happy and so glad to be part of the event. And I'm so happy that you found the right guy. Mommy wish you and Thomas all the best and everlasting love. Wish Thomas and Wendy, bye, Tao Xie Lao. Health, <laughs> <laughs>